Define programmatic policies. We want to make sure that we're defining policies to all aspects of multi-cloud management. So I'm talking about identity, I'm talking about security, I'm talking about governance, monitoring, all aspects of multi-cloud management, we need to define proper programmatic policies. We want to make sure that we are figuring out the basics, right? Who has access to what, when. So one user might have access to Azure virtual machines or Azure containers in one region in Europe and they might have full access there, but that same user might not have access to Salesforce, for example. So we want to make sure that we're putting the right programmatic policies because that's going to be one of the ways that we're going to be not only able to enforce them, but also able to scale this environment. So make sure that you're applying these policies across the board. Take all of the different aspects aspects of multi-cloud management. Like I said, again, you know, we're talking identity, we're talking security, we're talking governance, we're talking uh, provisioning, we're talking monitoring, all of the different aspects and make sure that there are proper policies that are applied there. This is going to be time consuming. This is going to be uh, difficult. You're going to have to make tweaks and changes until you arrive at an environment that is ideal. But this, this is important. This is crucial. This is foundational. Trust me, don't try to do this after the fact. Try to do this as early as possible. The earlier you do this, the easier it is. The later you do this, the harder it will become to fix this environment, to clean this environment up, and to be able to enforce the policies that you're trying to enforce without breaking things. So if you're watching this and you haven't begun on your cloud journey, on your multi-cloud journey, these policies are foundational.